Hey everybody, uh, I started doing this at the beginning of the year, and I said every Tuesday I'm making a video, and then uh, I was at MomoCon over the weekend, and we were driving home on Tuesday, and we were going to like, oh, we're going to get home late on Tuesday, and I wasn't even thinking about it, and then on the way home I realized that I wasn't going to be able to make a video if I got home late on Tuesday, but you know what I said? I said a deal's a got dang deal, and we're making a video. Even if it's probably not going to be the best one. Not that any of these are the best ones there all. But, I mean, y'all, who are, people watch them. So, we're going to keep making them. Um, that is the secret. I'll stop doing these if I get zero views. Probably not, actually. Because my dad will still watch it. My dad thinks I'm cool. Um, anyway, we were at Momocon. It was pretty great. Um, it was a, a, a very much a long drive. Uh, from Virginia to Georgia and hot. We didn't have AC in the car because uh, we po. And um, and uh, but yeah, it was it was fun. Uh, once we settled into the hotel and everything, uh, it was a very nice hotel. So that was I appreciate everything that the sh the show did uh, as a get for for me as a guest. Uh, I appreciate it. I got to do some panels um, with a lot of uh, cool people. Uh, so that was neat. I tabled next to other creators instead of like um, next to like craft makers and stuff. So that was really neat. Um, nothing. I mean, if you make crafts and you go to cons, I mean, I'm, I love you and I hope you make a lot of money. But like being around other comic creators is just, I, is preferred for me because I mean I, I want to hang out with my peers and stuff. Um, so that was cool. I uh, got us tabled around. Oh, I just hit the table. Um, who was there? There was Carmen Anderson. Uh, there was um, Starfish Face. Uh, you know what? I think she introduced herself as Starfish Face. Uh, so I don't think I know her real name. Maybe, I mean, that's what she prefers to be called, I guess. Um, Keith Browning. Uh, Christian Herrera. I talked about that in earlier videos. Um, Jarrett uh, Melendez. Um... Who else was there? There was all kinds of cool people. Uh, Robert Wilson the Fourth, um, Greg Elise. Uh, God, why did his name just live in my head? Is it Anderson? Greg Elise Anderson. Um, Greg Berman. Uh, Land Pitts was near. He was on the next aisle over, but he was still near. I got to talk to him. Uh, but yeah, it was a great time. Uh, Got to do, like I said, did panels on AI. I did a panel on uh, anthologies. I did a panel on being like behind, it was called Behind the Panels. It was like me and uh, uh, some colorists. Uh, uh, well, they were like colorist artists. They did a little bit of everything, but they had done coloring work, and that's why they were on it because it was like the people that are kind of like not the front of the house, kind of like the writer artist, um, the other kind of people that are working on the books. Uh, they should add an editor too, but uh, maybe they didn't have an editor as a guest. I don't know. But it doesn't matter. It was still great. I uh, had a good time. Uh, we bought a few. We didn't buy very much stuff. I didn't even buy this. Actually, I was given this. I met Jared. <clears throat> excuse me. Good Lord, I just burped in the video. Uh, Jared Melendez. I met him in the panel about anthologies. And he was talking about how he liked. Anyway, he did like cooking books and stuff. So I gave him a copy of um, Voyage de Gourmet from Mad Cave. And I was like, hey, I think you'll enjoy this. And he said he would. And he gave me one of his books. He gave me Chef's Kiss. Very cool. Dig that a lot. Um, what else did we get? We got from Carrie McGee, Kara McGee. We got Dodge City. And I also got my wife a sticker that says Broken Sleepy. Um, wait, the video's in the pictures in the way. I can't see it by showing her off right. Broken Sleepy. There you go. Um... I got a Nothing But Ads Giant Size from Rico Renzi, who also, I got a sticker, this one, Catch These Hands, got that from him, I got Anderson Carmen, uh, I got Fear Hunters, um, and Keith Browning let me have a copy of his Backtober 2023 uh, book, because uh, he's a swell guy, and um, I got some other, my, uh, my son walked around and talked to everybody. Uh, so many people took pictures with cosplayers. Uh, he was really excited to meet a bunch of people. Um, I would be, I walked up to a couple of tables and, uh, I was talking to him and then Jacob would walk up and they'd be like, Hey buddy. And, like they knew him again. 
And I was like, oh, this is actually my son. They're like, oh, we've been talking to him all day, you know. That's kind of neat. Um, everybody was so friendly to him and everything. Uh, daughter got some, um, what are those things called? Lanyards uh, from a bunch of people, including Shadi Amin, who was also right across from me. I'm, I forgot them. Um, forgot her. Uh, but yeah, so it was a good day overall. Uh, not overall. Uh, it was a good day altogether. Um overall again i don't know why i said not overall that's the right word um but yeah so it was a good times had by all um check out stuff i work on like i talk about every week uh american psycho from sumerian vixen nyc from dc uh over on webtoon is urban animal and nexus point uh over on kickstarter i believe madcaps is still running i forgot to check before i started the video the video uh the uh kickstarter for atlantic comic con still running there'll be links below uh the Ringo noms are over for right now. Let's see if I get nominated, and then we can vote and see if we can get me an award. Um, you know, if you so feel inclined. Um, don't have to promote MomoCon anymore because it already just happened. Uh, Heroes Con is coming up uh, June 14th and 16th in Charlotte. Durham Minicon August 3rd. Atlantic Comic Con August 17th and 18th. And Ocean City Comic Con December 14th and 15th. Um, I also talked to a guy, I'm going to do another, I think I talked about it before, a card and comic show. Uh, I've done it once before, I'm going to do that again, but I forgot to write down the date, so I'll talk about that next week. Um, so yeah, a bunch of stuff going on. Uh, I'm glad I got to make a video before uh, the Tuesday is over, and I hope you all like it. And I'll see you all next week where it won't be such a jumbled mess, and I won't look so haggard and tired. Uh, Y'all have a good week, and bye-bye.